Today, I'm gonna show you the sun through a telescope, a solar filter on it, and because the sun has just woken up. The past few days, we've seen dozens of C-class solar flares, four M-class solar flares, the first one since July 12th, as well as two coronal mass ejections, which the one might graze Earth in the coming days. All right, you wanna check this out? And here are those areas I'm talking about. Each one of those three in that triangle, a little bit bigger than Earth, okay? Now, the bottom two, that's 4168, and the top one is 4165. The bottom two though, they have released four M-class solar flares. Now these sunspot regions are just cooler areas on the sun's surface. There's magnetic fields causing them there. So powerful they inhibit the convection in those areas and cause a temperature drop. So they appear through a white light solar filter darker. I wanna show you this same area since the beginning of the month through hydrogen alpha, ready? This is the beginning of the month on the first. Now just the past few days, 4168 has exploded. These hydrogen alpha photos are from Star XX Kitten as well as Miss Zo Nova, all right? And you can see active region 4168 in this area right here, how it's developed over the past few days. The sun has just come alive. All right, and here's a screenshot through the white light solar filter. Keep an eye out for uh, the CMEs that might graze Earth. I don't think we'll get much more than a G1 in the next few days, but uh, the sun has woken up. It, it was pretty quiet there for a little while. All right. We'll see you soon.